as you know all of us we learn from each other's experiences here is me traveling muser sharing my experience in thailand here are 30 travel tips which no one is going to tell you directly dive into the first tip which is the season there are two seasons in thailand the number one is the wet season and the second one is the dry season people usually plan in during the dry season time to travel would be either october and early november or march and early april november december and january is like the peak season and the costs are soaring so how you should be planning your thailand trip in your 15 days of travel visa from india you can either explore the north of thailand or the south of thailand if you are planning to explore both it will be difficult because you'll be spending a lot of time in traveling so what i explored was the south of thailand you can enter from phuket and you can exit from bangkok this makes it like a full circle okay so this stays right in thailand at thousand baht you get a very decent good hotels avoid using agora uh, if you have the same property listed on booking.com at the same price go for booking.com whatever bookings you are making through these online booking portals call and confirm once this happened to us when we went to our stay where we had booked the rooms rooms are not available and they don't accept any bookings from the agora platform oh no. let's get into sim cards you can buy a sim card at the airport itself and it will cost you not more than 300 uh, baht the reason why we bought sim cards just in case you know he happens to be in a different location and i happen to be in a different location and we just want to you know connect over call and of course using google translators and google maps is such a necessity once you land anywhere in thailand there are so many travel agents the connectivity is so seamless they will pick you from your hotel and also they'll drop you at your next day okay guys so talking about scooters basically are available across thailand uh, you find scooters starting from 200 baht this is the best mode of transportation you can have for yourself um, if you are going during the peak season i would suggest you to rent a scooty and keep it with you currency exchange so i would suggest you don't do currency exchange at the airport it you'll be just happening to spend more money instead you can go to any currency exchange agency so if you are able to get a debit card at a zero percent markup on forex i mean that is the best thing or else you can use your mastercard or visa at any of the thailand atms for withdrawal but you will end up paying around 200 to 300 baht extra for using the atm so the most interesting point of the food the thai cuisine is really good um, you get amazing salads you get amazing thai curry i mean don't miss out on their thai curry 12th day i kind of became homesick there is a lot of indian uh, restaurants and cuisines across thailand you will find them so that should not be an issue now coming to the full moon party yay uh, full moon parties are famous parties in thailand which happens at kofangan and Kofangan is around half an hour ride from Koh Samui. So what I will suggest is that do add the full full moon party in your itinerary. For that, you'll have to basically find a hotel and book a hotel at Kofang Island itself. It's a small island, so the number of hotels are also limited, and it gets very very expensive during the peak season. So I, so I would suggest do check it out and plan way ahead. We happened to do this mistake. We had booked our hotel at Koh Samui and it was a lot of to and fro's to Kofangan Island. So your final tip and the last tip in this video, there's this store in Thailand uh, called as 7-Eleven. You'll find it in every 100 meters, there's a 7-Eleven. You get everything. You get microwaved food, you get snacks, you get drinks, alcoholic, non-alcoholic, cigarettes, everything. Just grab a microwave food. Those are so cheap and it's delicious as well. Guys, right, so that was the end of my tips while traveling to Thailand. I hope you found this video helpful you can also slide into my dms if there's any queries any questions which you want to ask me see you soon have fun and enjoy bye